These headphones are heavily underrated, so I'm gonna tell you why you may want to consider buying them. The DT177X are a collaboration between Bayer Dynamic and Drop. They come with a slightly janky cable in a pretty plain Jane box and include a second pair of pads which are the Kony sheepskins. You are left with a headphone that is very well made. I don't think these cans will ever break. And the only real downside, as that's not a spoiler, is the comfort. The stock pads are having a hard time to form a seal. So you might end up with a bit of channel imbalance. The isolation is also a bit of a weak point, at least with the stock pads, and the headband could do with a bit more clamp. If you take a look at the second pair of pads, those help in isolation, but introduce a lot of boominess in the base region, so I'm not too happy with them. Other than that, if you leave the stock pads on, they have a great sound. They have a very wide sound stage, but also a lot of detail. The bass has a slight bump, a slight boost. Sub bass is excellent, mids and treble are very well balanced. They don't have the Bayer peak. So if you are treble sensitive, these are non-offensive. I wouldn't use them to mix and master, but for everything else, they are just phenomenal headphones. So full recommendation from my side, really. And yeah, I think that should do it. The only other thing I can think of is really the janky cable, but you can get rid of that and go balanced at the same time because they are uh, able to go balanced and going balanced will give you maybe, although we are in the psychoacoustics uh, stage already, uh, a slight focus in the bass region, but it's really not needed. They are easily powered by everything and even something like a tube amp can really um, pay tribute to the sound signature of these. My X2O TA20 gave them a, an even wider sound stage. So really, they sound good on my Magni Heresy, my THX789, my A90, and uh, on the drop signature can amp they released pretty recently. So yeah, and even my cell phone can power them without any problem. So yeah, for recommendation, this is a no brainer. Go out and get them. They are my favorite Bayer Dynamic headphones I have listened to so far, so great headphones. If you like this video, please like and subscribe and then I'll see you on the next one. Until then, have a nice evening.